A few months ago, the government introduced comprehensive raft of regulations seeking to address the challenges milk producers in the country have been grappling with for decades while streamlining the dairy industry operations. The new dairy regulations have also given a new lease of life to farmers like Martha Modoni, who had earlier thrown in the towel and sold holder cows to start all over again with the help from a dairy processor in our area, the Canaan Factories Limited, who offered to provide knowledge and extension support. Sasa, lakini disikia kana nimekuja, nikasema sasa nitaansia kuweka ngombe. Juni kipereka huko, tunapata pesa. Hiyo siku hiyo igine tulikuwa tunapata pesa kidogo, tu sasa unaboeka. Nikaansia kurima, maidi, marago, hivu. Sasa diyo, niri, sasa niriasa, nitaansia sasa. So we train the farmers on feed management, feeding, and uh, milk hardening. To ensure that the milk that we receive at the canon is fresh and the good quality milk. A notable aspect of the new regulations is that the minimum farm gate prices of 33 shillings has been introduced and is expected to guarantee a minimum price on milk sales, which will ensure that their investment gives favorable returns throughout the year. Sasa una shida baka ukipereka masiwa. Sasa uko, unatamani siku ifike juu utapata pela. Lakini yo kitabu nilikuwa na uopa. Unapereka kwa duka, saigine wanashukua masiwa, saigine wanakata. Unakata, unaka, unakuwa na masiwa migi. Paka watu wakasi diyo ulikuwa na wape. Una haja ya masiwa. Lakini saa hii, masiwa, watu walime sana. Juko, wakona pesa mingi. While the state may appear to over-regulate the dairy industry, triggering concerns about the increased cost of production, it is important to note that each set of regulation addresses a specific industry issue. In other words, the comprehensive nature of the rule signals a pent-up need to anchor long-drawn policy reforms on a detailed legal framework covering all the salient issues facing the dairy sector something that the Canon factory CEO Amara Prit Sindhu agrees with. They are very good, you know, the, the regulations. They are in the interest of the dairy farmers. They help them get a good uh, minimum price for the milk. So they, they, they are like, you know, happy about it. And, you know, as, as a, another player in the industry, we are always in touch with the government organization, the KDB. We work with them very closely and uh, also with the farmers. So it's in the interest of both the farmers the processors as well as the consumers. The new regulations also seek to address seasonality of production, low productivity, poor quality, inaccessible feeds, and lack of an adequate regulatory framework. It provides for the safety of dairy products through the labeling, examination, calibration, record storage and distribution for the value chain actors, including dairy farms, collection centers, milk bars, milk dispensers, and processing establishments while enhancing product safety and consumer protection. Quality is very important in, to milk production because basically it's the backbone. Whatever we do here, we do it with the back of the mind for customer safety. So without quality, we cannot guarantee that the customer is going to find a safe product for use and also fulfill all those parameters that we have put in the packet in terms of nutrition. The new regulation will also help create a database of farmers, dairy herd and other valuable data that will inform future policy formulation. It will also assist in weeding out rogue milk hawkers and middlemen exploiting poor farmers and by mapping out where farmers are, facilitate coordinated extension support services by the counties. We are introducing you know, some uh, technology intervention with the farmers where we are giving them uh, extension services, how to improve their productivity in terms of you know, giving better nutrition to the animals. Also, you know, we are telling them about artificial insemination and the benefits of artificial insemination so that the next generation of the animals should be giving better yield than what they're doing right now.
The new regulation gives hope to small and new dairy players like the Canon Factory Limited to invest more and help their farmers improve their production through improved genetics, proper feeding advice, and how to maintain a high level of hygiene within their farms. Philip Keitang, KTN News.